Typhoon Shanshan made landfall on Japan's southwestern main island of Kyushu, the weather agency said, bringing heavy rain and strong winds that left at least 40 people injured in three prefectures. At least one person is missing. The Japan Meteorological Agency urged residents in affected areas to remain on high alert for natural disasters, while public transport operators canceled trains and flights, and some homes were left without power as the storm advanced. Bullet train services suspended and major companies like automaker Toyota have closed factories. Other major car manufacturers have followed suit, according to the Kyoto News Agency. Japanese authorities on Thursday warned that a life-threatening situation was imminent for towns in Kyushu's Oita Prefecture and urged 57,000 people to take live-saving actions as it issued its highest typhoon alert. A level 4 evacuation advisory, the second highest alert, is in place for all of Kyushu, affecting 3.7 million residents. A rare special typhoon warning issued for most parts of Kagoshima Prefecture was downgraded after the typhoon made landfall. Three members of a family died after a landslide buried a house in the central city of Gamagori, Kyoto reported, citing local government officials. The victims included a couple in their 70s and a son in his 30s, while two adult daughters in their 40s were injured, Kyoto added. The warnings indicate the possibility that a major disaster prompted by the typhoon is extremely high, Satoshi Sugimoto, chief forecaster of the meteorological agency, told. Shanshan comes in the wake of Typhoon Ampel, which disrupted hundreds of flights and trains this month. Despite dumping heavy rain, it caused only minor injuries and damage. Ampel came days after Tropical Storm Maria brought record rains to northern areas. very localized phenomena that's going on purely due to the volcano. When these gusts hit, they are very 